Why don't the club owners hire the germs anymore? Mm, we do get shows occasionally, but it is getting harder. I think there's a lot of bands now, and when we were first doing it, there weren't that many bands, and a lot of the new bands are just more cooperative as far as doing a sedate, safe stage show. There's no threat of um, an imminent riot. I've had promoters grab me and shake me and say, stop this show, it's on the verge of becoming a riot. Find me a fucking beer. I guess we used to do stuff. I mean, back, you know, it was good to have that kind of reputation then, you know, but um, not anymore, because now we can't play anywhere. Tell me, why, how, how is it that you're always getting hurt? Well, first I did on purpose. Yeah. To keep from being bored. He's come out of shows with huge scrapes and scratches and claw marks all over him and just pouring blood, but it always looks a lot worse than it is. What's the worst time you ever got hurt? Mm, the whisking. I cut my foot open. What happened? I like, came down the stairs to do, do an on course, and then I jumped on a half a broken glass like that, and like, I had to get like 30 stitches. So I was standing like right in front, and I was looking at his face, and, and like you ended up sitting down on the ground. And you were holding your foot like this, and you looked at it, and, and you just started going, ah, you know, and then you stopped playing and stuff, and we were running around trying to find your tennis shoes. And I had to go to the hospital with blue hair and stuff, and they were bringing all the nurses in and stuff to look at me. Why did you get so loaded to perform? Because that way I don't feel myself getting hurt. I mean, it's scary out there. No, it's real scary, like, because when we play, we're right down there in the audience, and there's lots of creeps up there. And there's lots of people that have grudges against us now, too. And so if I didn't get loaded, I wouldn't be able to do it. I just broke this egg. Well, we've tried everything to get him to do that. I've to talked do what? to him to sing into the mic. It's just like almost like the enemy or something. Stay away from it at all costs, it seems. So tell me why you don't sing into the mic, Darby. Just don't pay attention to it. I'm too loaded. We tried everything short of gluing his mouth to it. Yeah, this mic's not working. Things get broken, monitors, mics. But you kind of have to expect that if you hire an energetic young band. Darby, pick up the mic. The mic. got together as a band, they didn't know how to play their instruments, and they did things to kind of camouflage that. Darby would smear peanut butter all over him. He'd dive through broken glass. He'd break glasses on his head. And eventually, they learned how to play. <laughs>
Wrong, something, something better. 